to Cambridge. Hi, I'm Ben. I'm the graduate president at Cambridge SU. And I'm Asta, postgraduate president of Cambridge SU. When you enroll in the university, you automatically become a member of the Cambridge Student Union. The SU is a democratic student-led organization. Um, we have a team of eight full-time sabbatical officers and an elected executive committee. The policies of the SU are decided by this SU council. Um, the council is a forum where representatives elected in the colleges and in the departments come and represent the students voices, so they do so by presenting motions and debating these motions. In addition to the elected representatives, any student can come and present motions to council and uh, lobby for the changes that they want to see happen at the university. We sit on 17 university committees between us and represent the changes that students want to see in the university on those committees. Every college has its own representative bodies called JCLs for undergraduates generally and MCLs for postgraduates. JCLs and MCLs will run the freshest week that you've already had in college, so you should have got to know them a bit already. As university-wide representatives, we help JCLs and MCLs share knowledge and campaign across colleges on the issues that matter to all of them and they hold in common. Cambridge SU is a new organisation that for the first time ever represents undergraduates and postgraduates equally. This means that we can campaign more effectively on issues that affect both undergraduates and postgraduates. Siang and I are the Undergraduate and Postgraduate Access Education and Participation Officers, or AEP Officers for short. We work together to support Cambridge's academic rep system. Academic representatives are the voice of students in departments, faculties and schools. They work to improve your course and your overall educational experience here. You can identify your rep by logging into the Cambridge SE website and run in our November elections. One of my main projects is the shadowing scheme, a scheme which is designed to give an insight into what student life is like here for Year 12 students who are less likely to apply to Cambridge due to their background. This is just one of the many access projects run at Cambridge, which is coordinated by the SU, access officers and groups across the university. Siang and I work together to support students in their access efforts throughout the year and to work generally to improve the diversity and the accessibility of the university. I also work specifically on postgraduate issues. My role is new, so it's very exciting. But some of my main projects this year will be to make funding available to disadvantaged postgraduate students and improve postgraduate academic and pastoral support. I'm also keen to represent postgraduates not just as students, but as university workers. If you're a postgraduate student, you can sign up here to join UCU and you can also get four years of free membership. The SU has seven campaigns that represent different student groups across the university. Three of the campaigns are full-time sabbatical officer and all the campaigns meet regularly with the sabbatical officer team and SU staff so that all campaigns are properly supported. As a disabled students officer, I help run the disabled students campaign, which is open to all students who have had, currently have or may have a disability, such as a physical condition, mental illness or learning difficulty. We have a community group on Facebook where you can meet other people like you and we run loads of social events where you can share experiences. You're welcome to join us at any time throughout your degree. I also sit on university committees representing disabled students and pushing for the changes that are chosen by them. For example, providing clearer information on how to go part-time during undergrad or offering different modes of assessment like coursework. As the BME officer, I work alongside the SU BME campaign and JCR and MCR BME reps to support and represent all students who self-identify as Black and Minority Ethnic. I also work in collaboration with student-led groups that campaign for racial and social justice. Whether you're looking for a safe space to share your experiences and connect with other BME students, or you want to get involved in campaigns to strengthen BME student representation and tackle racism, there's something for everyone. So do keep an eye out for all the exciting events and forums that the BME campaign has planned for the year. I'm Chloe, the Women's Officer, and most of my work takes place through the Cambridge SU Women's Campaign. The Women's Campaign acts as a community building space where women and non-binary students can build networks of solidarity and collective care. I work with the campaign to advocate for the needs of women and non-binary students at an institutional, cultural and social level. Alongside campaigning activities, the Women's Campaign acts as a space for building networks of solidarity and collective care amongst its members. There are lots of ways to get involved in the work of the campaign, coming to our weekly forums or coming to our social events and regular discussion groups. We're always open to new faces and ideas in our safe space, whether you're an incoming undergraduate student, postgraduate student or current student. We look forward to seeing you this term. All campaigns have a Facebook page and a page on our website 
so look them up to find our term cards and contact them. Hi, I'm Alice. I'm the Welfare and Community Officer. I work with JCR and MCR Welfare Officers to fight for changes in the university to support students' welfare. Um, the community aspect also means I work with local community groups like trade unions, like UCU, Unite, Unison, as well as local initiatives and connect them back with what students are doing here. So for example, a couple of the things I'm working on at the moment are campaigning for a fossil free university and fighting for fair pay and fair representation for all workers across the university. Because of this work, it means I work a lot with student campaigns. So for example, the Student Union Ethical Affairs Campaign, which is a group of amazing students working for climate and social justice across Cambridge, as well as groups like Cambridge Zero Carbon, the Living Wage Campaign and Cambridge Defend Education. You should really go and check them all out. They will do really incredible work. Of course, COVID has changed the way that we are all returning to university life, but I can assure you that the sabbatical team is working as hard as we can to put welfare and safety um, at the centre of our work. And while we are campaigning and representing the students, we don't do case work, so if you do want specific tailored support, we suggest you go to the Student Advice Service. This runs through the Students Union and provides free, confidential and independent advice for all students at the university. A vital part of being a student at Cambridge is getting involved in campaigning on different issues. Whether you're involved in a specific topic like anti-racism or climate justice, or just want to find out what's going on in Cambridge in general, make sure to attend Political Freshers Week, where we'll have events about all of these different topics and ways for you to get involved.